Hi everyone, my name is Peter. Thanks for joining me at Our Worship Sound. I want to talk to you a little bit about Main Stage, and maybe you've heard me talk about it before, um, but if you don't know what it is, Main Stage is an inexpensive music program for Mac computers. Um, I have to say that if you're a keyboard player and you have a Mac and you're not using Main Stage, you're really missing out because it is extremely powerful. Now, because it's so powerful, it can be difficult to know how to get started with it, but you don't have to remain stuck there. I want to quickly show you how I use it on a weekly basis with my church band, um, and then I want to teach you everything that you need to know to get to that same point. So let's open up Main Stage, and the first thing that we're going to see is that my physical setup is represented. Uh, I've set it up so that it shows up in this software. So I've created this where it fits my setup. I have my keyboard, and then I just have this simple MIDI controller with drum pads and knobs. And it's mapped through a MIDI connection so that when I play keys on my keyboard or I press drum pads or I turn knobs, that the same thing happens in the software. So everything is all set up, um, and I just start with that on a weekly basis. And so, at this point, I'm ready to add songs or add patches to it. Now, let's say that we're going to do three songs. And for the first two, I'm going to use more of a second keyboard synthesizer approach. And so I'm going to add two songs, Our God and Say the Word. And then for the third song, I'm going to play more of a primary first keyboard approach. And so let's go there and then Forever. Now, after that short amount of time, I am completely ready to play. Okay, everything that I have is there and it is ready to go. Let's take a look at these songs. I'm going to click these triangles so we can see what's in these folders. And we can see that we have multiple patches for each song. And these patches are going to fit different parts of each song. I'm going to switch between them by just pressing drum pads on my MIDI controller. It's much easier than clicking around on the computer. So on Our God, it's mostly about different synth sounds. And I'll just switch at different points in the song. Let's listen to Say the Word. Okay, and then for my third song, I'm going to use kind of a layered piano sound. This first patch is set up for softer sections of the song. Then I have this for medium. Then as the song builds even more, we've got this third patch. Then we can end soft. So that's how I use MainStage on a weekly basis. It doesn't take a lot of time and it sounds really good. Now to help you get to that same point, I've created the MainStage keyboard course. And it's gonna walk you through every step that you need to have your own custom template where it fits your setup, to have all the skills and the settings that you need to control MainStage sounds smoothly, and to know what it takes to put together sounds that fit every song in your band's repertoire. I don't want you to get bogged down with main stage because it can really inspire you to new levels of keyboard playing. So to purchase the course or to find out more about it, click on the link in the upper right hand corner of this video, or you can go to ourworshipsound.com slash mainstage course. The course has over two dozen videos and it will walk you through every step of the process to put you in complete control of main stage. It doesn't have to take months and even years like I did to get to that point. You can pick up this knowledge in a very short amount of time. So to find out more about the course or to get started right away, go to ourshipsound.com slash mainstage course. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.